And lastly, Chinese astrology. Decode the zodiac to live your best life. Hardcover. So, yeah, I got this because I was curious. Because I know what my zodiac is, but... Oof. Uh, I don't know everything about it. So, we have our index. Let me fix... There we go. Yeah, me, I am a cancer. So, my Chinese uh, animal is the tiger. So, 208 pages. Let's see what this thing has. There we go. Alrighty. So, five elements. Cool. Yeah. yeah, a lot of people don't know shit about me, which is kind of was as funny as shit. Yeah. Like, I know what you are. Like, no, you don't. Where the hell am I at? February. I'm just looking at this shit too. I'm like, where is it? If... Yep. Tiger. <laughs> yep. So this is fascinating. I didn't even look at this shit. I'm really impressed. Good colors. Fuck yeah. And then there's the signs. So I am... Oh, there we go. Confident, tolerant, and courageous. Yep, that's me. <laughs> so you get rat years, start date, end date, heavenly stem, earthly branch, characteristics by year. Okay, that's pretty cool. And by their month, and then you get advice. And facts and your strengths and weaknesses. Okay. Let's see what the fuck mine is because I have no clue. Good stuff though. I'm always fascinated by what I come across when I'm looking for something to read or just cover on the channel because I like branching out. It's fun. Fandom stuff, way too fucking easy. Whereas other stuff is more enticing and more integral for me, to be honest. Yep, yeah, Fire Tiger. Definitely me. <laughs> so I am the energetic because I'm a July baby. <sighs> Oh, my lucky numbers are one, three, four. Huh. Numbers, days, colors, directions, flowers. Wow, even flowers. Holy shit, dude. Hm, that's cool. Oh boy, here's my strengths and weaknesses. Confident, tolerant, loyal, courageous, trustworthy, intelligent, determined, fair. Yeah, I can be argumentative, but my temperament is really calm. I'm not as arrogant. Man, my temper is kind of short sometimes. I am semi-hasty. I'm not treacherous anymore. I am outspoken. I'm barely aggressive, though. Like, I've changed a lot. In the fuck. Friendship and love. The boar. Okay. Now I gotta find some chick that's got a boar tramp stamp on her ass. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I love it. That's too cool. But if you don't like Zodiac, well, this is not for you. But if you do hardcore believe in that, then yeah. It's definitely for you. I know Dino's a dragon. Yeah, that's why me and him get along so well. Because we have some of the same characteristics and shit.
Wheel of Love. Interesting. <laughs> so you got your perfect pairings. And then you have your bad matches. Well, of course, Tiger and Monkey is a bad idea. <laughs> Rip that fucker apart. <laughs> All this bitch is going to do is fling shit at me. <laughs> Drag my balls across his face. <laughs> yep, that's me being aggressive. Ah, that's too funny. But yeah, I will go back and reread my Zodiac entirely because I am curious now. <sighs> I do like the art in this book though, it's really colorful. And the text, the background is absolutely on point. Like, it's absolutely great. You can read it. It's not, you know, hard on your eyes unless you have vision issues. Then, yeah, you're going to need a magnifying glass and shit. Or someone to read it for you. If you can't really read that well. Um, what else? If you just want to buy a book to collect, just to have it on your shelf and be like, yeah, I'm cool, look at me, I know my Zodiac. Oh, yeah, that's a good book for that. Um, if you don't care about Zodiacs, not the shit for you, then. <laughs> look at that, you're just going to be flinging shit in a relationship. Legend of the Twelve Animals. Oh, boy. The cock. Nobody wants to be a cock. <laughs> I'd rather be a monkey than I can just fling shit at people. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, my. I'm kind of surprised that dog and tiger don't go together because they're both, you know, protective and loyal and shit. Oh, well. Look at that, Garden of Fucking Mountains. Awesome. <laughs> oh, how cute. But I do like that. That's some really cool shit. You get numbers, days, colors, directions, and flowers. That's pretty cool. I like that shit. If you wanted to do characters based on Chinese Zodiac, this is a good starting point for you, easily. Beliefs and traditions. That's cool. Wow, food for good luck. Nice. Yeah, I will definitely be looking at some of this shit again. Wow. I like it. Good book. And there's your author. And we're done. So, uh, I'll be back. I don't know when. You'll see me when you see me. Till next time, like and subscribe for thoughts and prayers.